iDetect is a major breakthrough in the credibility assessment uh, industry, if you want to call it an industry. There are, have been historically different approaches to assessing credibility of prospective employees or people who are already employees, giving them paper and pencil tests to test their so-called integrity, to see their suitability, and so on. And these are widely employed at some cost to companies and governments and so on. Yet the scientific evidence shows they simply don't work. Now you have other things like voice stress that have been used and those don't work either. The breakthrough with iDetect is that it's a simple automatic technology that is scientifically valid, relatively inexpensive to use, and does not incur the risk of bias. One of the things that caused problems for polygraph in the United States and in other countries is the possibility of misuse of the technique. We had historically in the United States polygraphs being used in employment screening <clears throat> where people were running shoddy tests, quickie tests, 15 or 20 minutes instead of two or three hours, and they were used in discriminatory ways too. So they got outlawed in the United States for that application in the Employee Polygraph Protection Act. iDetect overcomes all of those problems because iDetect does not have a possibility of bias. It's all automated. The, there is not an examiner to influence the outcome. It's all computer analyzed. The person taking the test takes the test administered by a computer. And so you don't have any of those problems. And it's quick, much less expensive, and you can then screen large numbers of people in a short period of time. There are a lot of non-believers uh, in this technique in terms of their initial impression. They don't know anything about it. And people have similar reactions a lot to polygraphs. But once they understand what it is, how it works, and the scientific evidence that shows that it works, mock crime studies as well as field studies and real screening situations have shown that this technique is capable of producing accuracy at least 85% which is as high as one could claim for the use of polygraphs in screening situations. The federal government uses polygraphs widely for all national security purposes, law enforcement purposes, you know, vetting people, government contractors with direct access to classified information, and this technique can be used in the same way with the same level of validation, probably higher accuracy than the average screening polygraph which is widely used. And we can show the data. The data have been published in top-level scientific journals. This is not just claims like for voice stress where they claim it's really very accurate and there's absolutely no evidence to support it. In fact, the federal government says, based on their studies, it doesn't work at all and you're not allowed to use it in the federal government. Polygraphs have been the standard, but iDetect has great advantages over polygraphs and we can show the scientific evidence that demonstrates its accuracy and it has wide applicability.